guys, Big Dipper 351 back, yet another Mud Jug unboxing. Hey, 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 look at that. Hey, hey. We'll uh, throw in a dip here real quick. Of course, I'm doing my regular uh, Copenhagen extra long cut. And I hate that label, by the way. Obama, you suck. See, Sergeant Spitter, I remember three taps is enough. Get one in here real quick, and we'll get to the unboxing here and get this done. Uh, boy. It's been kind of sitting around today. Got up the other morning. Well, I'll get into that after I do the unboxing. But get this in and uh, get on with the unboxing. I've been waiting for this. Okay, I'm cutting it open. Okay. okay. Yeah, real smart, huh? Bringing a knife towards my neck. That's not too bright. I'll do it down here. There we go. Of course, my jug of the day is the Rebel Flag Southern Pride, which I guess uh, will be out in a few weeks. I think Darcy said he had some problems, so that'll be coming out. Let's see what we got here. Oh man, that's cool. I like this one. Now, I got two of each. There's me, Coke King 09. Uh, I'm going to get a clear on this. Here's the first one. Let me. Got two. Two monies. Cool. Like those. Thanks, Darcy and Jeff. That's cool. And the new one that just came out too that is badass I love that look at this guys snow camo that is cool got two of those too that is nice got two of those that is really neat. Darcy and Jeff, thanks a lot, man. Appreciate it. That is cool. Got, uh, got those, and uh, I think that brings my collection to... Darcy you probably know this better than I would. I'll have to count them all again. I think that brings me to 30 mud jugs. I know he keeps counting of them, so uh, I think that's 30 I got now. And it's not the last, I guarantee you that. I'll be getting more. Definitely. As they come out, I'll be getting more. I'm not going to spit in those right away. i got this one still going, so we'll do that one. Uh, haven't been doing much, and uh, just been kind of... Got up the other morning to go fishing. <laughs> Me and Coke King 09 got up the other day to go fishing, catfishing at 4 o'clock in the morning. Got down to the dam at 5, only to find out they closed the dam. They, uh, it was in the paper or in the on the website that the dam was it was open. You know the floodgates were uh, open last week. Then they closed them, and that's when the catfish start biting in that pool there. And uh, got down there, they closed again. They're doing maintenance. I read in the paper today that uh, every six to eight years they have to do maintenance on it. They close it down. Get this, close the dam down. get a crane up on top of the dam where the floodgates are there's a there's a pool and it goes into the Caney River well they close the dam down they shut the gates close the dam down put the crane up on top they got these uh, big cages they lower it down in the water where the pool is it's about 
I don't know, about 30, 40 feet deep. They, oh, first they bring in pumps and they pump out all the water, empty it out. Then they put things down there, big cages, and they gather up all the fish, lift them up, take them over to the lake, you know, across the dam on the other side, and empty them. They said they found tons of catfish, 10, 20 pounds. They caught three 50 pound flatheads out of there. Man, I wish I could have hooked onto one of those suckers. Right there where we fish, because it can't get out of there. It comes in a pool, and then there are concrete pillars, and, and a little little dam. They can't get over that. So when they get in that pool, they're there. They're not getting away. And uh, oh man, wish I could have caught that. They caught one spoonbill, which is very rare. You don't see those too many around here. And uh, oh, a bunch of them, 10, 20, 30 pounds and uh, a lot of gar and stuff that way but uh, they caught a 50 pound uh, drum which is a shit fish it's kind of like a carp fun to catch but shit fish that's all they do is eat shit anyway <laughs> so they closed it we didn't get to go fishing came home disappointed and uh, haven't been back up there since I just read they opened it but if they open it now hopefully some more fish will flow down in there I hope so but uh, it doesn't look too good for probably a couple of weeks. What gets me mad is they did this. Uh, let's see, today's Thursday. Yes, yeah, yesterday, Wednesday. They did this on Wednesday. Well, right now is June 24th. Around this time is when the catfish start spawning, and they go and do that and take out all the fish, which is stupid. But you know, they could have picked a better time to do it than than this week. But anyway, it'll get better. We'll go out fishing again. We were kind of disappointed. Lakes are still high because of all the rain we got. We got a good storm through here last night. We got a thunderstorm. No tornadoes, but uh, boy, some 50 mile an hour winds broke some branches and stuff and uh, some heavy thunder and lightning. But other than that, not much. Other than that, we haven't been doing a lot. We've just been sitting around here. I just wanted to get this video out real quick, this unboxing, and uh, let everybody see them. And uh, just talk a little bit about the fishing, I guess. Uh, Coke King 09, he's in there in bed, I think. He's not feeling too good. Got kind of sick this morning. I don't know. Hope he's not getting the flu, but and if he does, he better not pass it to me. I'll beat his ass. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> but, uh, well, I guess I'll get out of here soon, and uh, that's all I wanted to get in here and just do this dip video real quick on this. I don't know what my time is because I didn't set the timer. Stupid me. Then I got to process this and download it on the stick and then put it on my Mac. This camera here takes better pictures than my Mac, really, I think. So maybe it's just because of lighting in here with the Mac. But I'll get it on the Mac and uh, do all the editing and all that stuff. So anyway, guys, we'll get out of here. We'll catch you later. Uh, no real shout-outs this time. Just, uh, of course, the Mud Jug one, Darcy, Jeff, of course. And uh, see Outlaw Dipper, Cajun Tiger 616, uh, Texas Tobacco. Texas Tobacco on my last one. I named everybody at the dip retreat, and I think I forgot your name. I'm sorry I did not do that on purpose, so I'll try to say it this time. Texas Tobacco. Watch his videos, man. He is cool. Uh, these are all the guys that were at the dip retreat and uh, a bunch of other ones, but I'm not going to tell them all because I think I'm about ready to run out of time. Anyway, we'll get out of here. We'll catch you guys later. Keep your lips full and your spit flowing. Bye.